viewers welcome to our new video in this video we will going to cover human eye mcq so let's start the video what is the transparent front part of the eye that covers the iris in fafil lens cornea retina sclera so the correct answer is option b cornea is the transparent front part of the eye that covers the iris in fafil the process of changing the curvature of the lens to focus on nearby objects is known as accommodation, refraction, convergence, dilation. So the correct answer is option A. The process of changing the curvature of the lens to focus on nearby objects is known as accommodation. Which part of the eye adjusts its size to control the amount of light entering? Eris retina lens optic nerve so the correct answer is option a iris part of the eye adjusts its size to control the amount of light entering in low light conditions which type of cells in the retina are primarily active rod cells corn cells ganglion cells bipolar cells So the correct answer is option A. In low light conditions, rod seals in the retina are primarily active. In the context of eye anatomy, what does the term sclera refer to? Transparent front part of the eye, color part of the eye, white outer layer of the eye, light sensitive layer at the back of the eye. So the correct answer is option C. In the context of eye anatomy, the term sclera refer to white outer layer of the eye. A cornea transplant is never rejected in humans because it consists of enucleated cells, it is a non-living layer, it has no blood supply, none of these. So the correct answer is option C. A cornea transplant is never rejected in humans because it has no blood supply. Which part of the eye regulates the amount of light entering the retina? Lens, iris, cornea, sclera. So the correct answer is option B. Iris part of the eye regulates the amount of light entering the retina. A person sees an object closer to his eyes. What changes will take place in his eyes? The fulfilled size will expand. The ciliary muscle will contract. The focal length of the eye lens will increase, the light entering the eye will be more. So the correct answer is option B. A person sees an object closer to his eyes, the ciliary muscles will contract. What is the primary function of the cornea? To protect the eyes, to provide color to the eyes, to help in focusing on object, to produce tears. So the correct answer is option C. The primary function of the cornea is to help in focusing on objects. What is the primary function of the sebaceous ciliary glands associated with the eyelashes? To produce tears, to drain lacrimal fluid, to release sebum, to help in focusing on objects. So the correct answer is option C. To release sebum is the primary function of the, of the sebaceous ciliary gland associated with the eyelashes. In a bright light environment, what happens to the size of the fulfills? They dilate, they remain unchanged, they oscillate, they constrict. So the correct answer is option D. In a bright light environment, the size of the pupil will constrict. The optic nerve leaves the eyeball at the site known as the optic disc, ciliary body, lens capsule, retinal layer. So the correct answer is option A. The optic nerve leaves the eyeball at the site known as the optic discs. What is the function of the aqueous humor in the eye? Focusing light on the retina nourishing the cornea and lens, transmitting signal to the brain, adjusting the shape of the iris.
So the correct answer is option B. The function of the FS humor in the eye is nourishing the cornea and lens. Which type of seals in the retina are responsible for detecting color? Rod seals, corn seals, ganglion seals, bipolar seals. So the correct answer is option B. Corn seals in the retina are responsible for detecting color. Which eye structure is responsible for protecting and supporting the eyeball? Conjunctiva, scleria, cornea, choroid. So the correct answer is option B. Scleria is responsible for protecting and supporting the eyeball. What is the space between the upper and lower eyelids known as? Fulfibral fissure, bulbar conjunctiva, tympanic membrane, vestibular branch. So the correct answer is option A. The space between the upper and lower eyelids known as pulfibral fissure. What is the function of the optic nerve? Transmitting signals to the brain, controlling fulfill size, focusing light on the retina, adjusting the shape of the lens. So the correct answer is option A. The function of the optic nerve is transmitting signal to the brains. What is the primary function of the ciliary muscles in the eye? Adjusting the shape of the lens, producing tears, controlling fulfill size, transmitting signal to the brains. So the correct answer is option A. The primary function of the ciliary muscles in the eye is adjusting the shape of the lens. The change in the focal length of human eye is caused due to ciliary muscle Fulfill, cornea, iris. So the correct answer is option A. The change in the focal length of human eye is caused due to ciliary muscle. The amount of light entering the eye can be controlled by iris, fulfill, cornea, ciliary muscle. So the correct answer is option B. The amount of light entering the eye can be controlled by the fulfill. Color portion of eye that controls amount of light reaching retina is known as cornea, fulfill, iris, retina. So the correct answer is option C, iris. Thanks for watching. Subscribe MCQs1 for latest informative MCQs.